In this video, I want to show you how to fix Counter-Strike Go in case it's not opening up in Windows. Regardless if you have Windows 10 or 11, you just keep click on it and it refuses to launch. Now, this specific icon here is unique for me, but I know your Counter-Strike strike icon on your desktop may look different. So, first thing to do, if you haven't restarted your computer, go ahead and restart it and then see if you're able to get in. Then after you restart, Counter-Strike. What I want you to do is find the logo, logo, find the logo on your desktop, and what I want you to do is right-click it. So click right-click, left-click properties, and then from here, what I want you to do is right here where it says Run compa Compatibility Troubleshooter. Click on Compatibility up here on the bottom right, Compatibility. Then click on Run Cap Compatibility Troubleshooter. That'll take a few minutes apply it and then see if that will fix your issue okay and if not what I want you to do is try to do an update on the uh, the language so for counter-strike it's squirrel so if you want to on the bottom left of your computer Windows 10 or whatever just type in squirrel to uh, do an update on on the uh, the language uh, I have Java here but you know counter-strike uses squirrel most likely that's not your issue so let's go ahead and move on and so what I want you to do is make sure you do a Windows update, regardless if you have Windows 7, Windows 10, 11. So what you're going to do is on the very bottom left, type in update for the later versions of Windows. And then for like Windows 7, click on the little Microsoft icon, click on the magnifying glass, type in update, and click on update. And you may not have the recent Windows update. Go ahead and click on update, restart the computer, and then see if Counter-Strike will open up when you click it. Next thing I want you to do is update update the video driver. So in order to do that, what I want you to do is, again, like we showed you earlier, type in Device Manager here on the bottom left, then click Device Manager. Then it's going to take you to all the drivers. So locate Display Adapters. And then what I want you to do is click on it, and then click whatever the video card is. So this is GeForce, but it may be Intel for you, or AMD, whatever you have. Click on it and then update the driver. You just got to make sure you're connected to the internet. Update the driver. That'll take a few minutes. And it might say you have the current update is up to date. That's fine. If not, uninstall it and then let's go to the next one. So what I showed you earlier in the video is what I want you to do is on the icon, I want you to right click on the icon of Counter-Strike again like you did earlier in the video. You're going to right click it. And then what you're going to do is left click properties like earlier then click on compatibility and then what I want you to do is check this where it says run the program in compatibility mode 4 click on that and choose Windows Vista and then from there I want you to apply and then click OK and then see if you're able to open up the icon for Go and if you can, you can go back in here and then switch it back to Windows 10, whatever operating system that you have. Okay? If you've tried all that, the, the really the only solution left is to uninstall uh, CounterForce and then uh, reinstall it. And to do that, you just type in Programs down here, and then Add or Remove Programs. And then it should be like the highest space. So just click on uh, Itemize All Your Apps by Size and then go will be on the very top go ahead and click on it and then uninstall and then reinstall it restart your computer and then that should fix the issue all right i appreciate you watching and make sure you subscribe